ITP block. It is inter-transverse process block. It is one of the paravertebral block by proxy or indirect paravertebral block. It is known by various names like MTP block, which is mid-transverse process to pleura block, multiple injection costotransverse block, sub-transverse process interligamentary block, or costotransverse foramen block. It is mainly indicated for brace surgeries or thoracotomies. This block targets the retro superior costotransverse ligament space, which has more direct and closer pathway to thoracic paravertebral space, and it appears to be anatomically more advantageous than ESP block or retro laminar block. Like other interfacial plane block, ITP block cannot be considered as an interfacial plane block as it targets the tissue in the space posterior to the superior costotransverse ligament. This tissue complex is called as intertransverse tissue complex that consists of intertransverse ligament, fatty tissue, intertransverse and levatorous costarum muscle, and superior costotransverse ligament. So, why it is called as paravertebral block by proxy? If you see in this sagittal section uh, of intertransverse process region, you can see that the area posterior to the superior costotransverse ligament, it appears directly communicated with the thoracic paravertebral space via the slit structure of the superior costotransverse ligament and via the costotransverse space. Due to communication between the retro superior costotransverse ligament and the thoracic paravertebral space, the anatomical studies consistently demonstrated paravertebral spread of the dry injected into the ITP region along with the sympathetic involvement. The dye injected into the ITP region, it spread multidirectionally from the injection point which is retro superior costotransverse ligament space into the paravertebral space through the costotransverse foramina and then intercostal space and erector spiny muscle compartments. It involves dorsal rami, ventral rami of the spinal nerve as well as the sympathetic ganglion. This is another dye study where 5 ml of the dye solution was injected at T2, T4, T6, T8 and T10 levels bilaterally which showed consistent spread over the paravertebral space, intercostal nerves and sympathetic chain. For MTP block, the linear ultrasound probe is kept parasagittally over the upper thoracic region to obtain the sononatomy picture that involves trapezius muscle, rhomboid muscle and erector spiny muscle above the tip of the transverse process. Between the transverse process there lie the intertransverse process ligament and anterior to the superior costotransverse ligament will be the paravertebral space which is limited anteriorly by the hyperechoic pleura. So the injection point of MTP block or ITP block will be the midpoint between the tip of the transverse process to the pleura. So it lies into the retro SCTL space into the tissue complex posterior to the superior costotransverse ligament. After obtaining the sonar anatomical picture, two points are marked representing the tip of the adjacent transverse process and those points are connected by one line. Second line is drawn over the pleural surface, hyperechoic pleural surface and third line is drawn connecting both the lines. Now the midpoint of the third line which is blue line marked that is the drug deposition point, injection point for the ITP block. So it always lie posterior to the superior costotransverse ligament into the retro SCTL tissue complex. Thank you so much.